Oh, don't, don't, Sick. don't shoot at me. <laughs> Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. So today I will be finally reacting to Breeze Corleone's new song featuring Ash 22 and it's called 667 in English, but I'm pretty sure it is French drill rap music because I got this request many, many times on my first reaction ever to French drill, which was Kasab with Gazo and Tia Cola. And I really liked that song, but I'm a little bit nervous diving into this genre because I know that it's very intense. And as you can probably tell by my appearance, I'm not a very intense person. So we're gonna see if I like this song though. I'm gonna be completely honest and objective about it. And maybe it has English subtitles, that would be very nice. But if not, we're just gonna look at the rest of the things of the song, just how it sounds and the cadence and stuff in the video. So without further ado, let's get into it. If you guys wanna see my reaction, then keep watching and see how I get surprised and shocked probably. And if you like this kind of content, don't forget to comment that down below. Give me any other recommendations and subscribe, like the video, and yeah, let's get into it. Let's go. Okay, let's get into it. Let's start. Sounds very ominous. Par contre, Dieu, ils adorent le bout. On arrive, on instaure le doute. Chaque somme au minimum, je doute. À quoi dans le 4 4 et dans le coup Si vous voulez nous fermer, ils ont échoué. Le plan de Dieu est impossible à déjouer. On n'est plus des gamins, mais on a déjoué. Europe à tous les migrants qui ont échoué. On aime les BM et les Benz. Les VVS et les Benz. On a les bleus et les bang. Quatre dates de prod, j'ai des peines. En 21, Corleone, H22, c'est les parties 4. J'arrive mal fond, les parties. Pas grand, moi, j'ai tous les as de la partie 4. Okay, really quick, let's just first impression of Freeze Corleone. I really like his flow so far. It's not nothing too crazy yet, but I can feel that the beat is picking up. And then he's just talking about, I guess, um, how much money he's made and how successful he is at what he does, which I can get behind that. That's great. Um, it's definitely a message in a lot of rap music that I enjoy. I like that type of rap topic i guess yeah and then obviously the beat is pretty intense i can feel it building up yeah okay that's first impressions i guess and i think freeze corleone is the only one who's uh said anything thus far <laughs> Okay, so another part of drill that I obviously won't understand is all of the references they're making. I can get some of it, but most of it, it's just kind of going past my head. If you guys think that there's anything I need to know specifically about what he's referencing in this part, feel free to let me know down in the comment section below, uh, especially because I'm interested in this genre, so I wanna check out more stuff. And if there's something like someone they're calling out or something that they're referencing that is gonna come up a lot or that I need to know, like if I'm getting into Freeze Corleone, then you can go ahead and let me know if you know that information. I'm surprised so far, I will say, that I haven't seen any, well, so far, <laughs> I haven't seen any references to women yet that I am not a fan of, um, but we're gonna see how this progresses. And again, there might be something that I missed, so yeah, we'll see. <laughs> All in all, the beat is actually 
laid back. It's still drill, but it's like a laid back drill, you know what I mean? They still got the same instruments, well not like instruments, but like sounds that they're using in the background that go makes it drill, basically, or typical of a drill style song, right? But it hasn't gotten super, super aggressive in the chorus or anything, or like the main hook of it. Yeah, so I kind of like this song so far because it's not so much in your face, but that is part of, like that's part of drill. So I really appreciate the genre for what it's trying to do, you know what I mean? Yeah. <laughs> His voice, oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> so the lyrics are getting real intense, <laughs> but his voice, his voice surprised me because I thought at the beginning of his verse that it was just an extension of the hook slash like chorus thing. And I thought it was an a, vo a vocal effect that was just there for like spice, but then it turns out to actually be his voice and that's super cool. Uh, I love rappers with really deep vocal tones. I think that it's the most appealing for me personally. And he seems to have that and he is wearing a mask this whole time. I wonder if it's because of all of the risky business that he's involved in that he's referencing in this song. You guys can let me know, but yeah. <laughs> this is my shocked face. <laughs> Okay, wow. I might interpret this completely wrong, but it says part four. So does that mean that there's like other parts to this song? And it's like, um, what do they call them? Like a cipher? Is that what it's kind of like? Let me know guys. Yeah. I'm confused. I'm confused right now. <laughs> but the beat is really good. a jump scare is going to happen because of this ominous piano-y electronic sound. What is... What is happening? Oh, okay. Oh, don't, don't, don't shoot at me. <laughs> I'm going to have this stuck in my head. over whoa okay first introduction to freeze corleone final thoughts on the song that was my second time ever reacting to or seeing french drill rap music and freeze corleone seems to be very popular um, with you guys. So if you guys want to let me know, as I said before in the video, any other information about him or any references that like I need to know, please leave them down in the comment section. Overall thoughts on the song, I thought that the message itself was at least understandable. Not something that I can personally relate to, but it was something that I can see like, oh, that's a valid topic to write a song about. The vibe of the song itself really matched the message that they were going with. Like it wouldn't make sense to rap about secretive activities over a crazy hard beat. It's way better to do it in the way that they did, which is to have this ominous beat 
and then the person that they ch uh, that Freeze Corleone chose or that they collaborated um, together, Ash22 in English, <laughs> he uh, sounded really good with this type of topic. Like his voice was really deep and it gave me that like, uh, like kind of feeling like, oh no, watch out, which I think is what he's trying to do because evidently he's responding to someone or something that's um, trying to like attack him or take him down a notch. And he did it in such a way that ma really makes you like kind of scared of him. You're like, oh my God, this guy's scary, which is exactly what he's trying to do. Any comments you guys want to leave anything, put them down in the comment section and don't forget to like, comment, well, comment and subscribe. Don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you all next time. Bye.